Hey, Tom here from King's Auto Repair, and I just want to follow up on that Audi oil burning video that I did. A lot of people are like, hey man, where you at? What are you doing? Um, we've been quite busy here at the shop, so I haven't had time to make videos. Uh, we're shops actually empty Friday night, so I'm following up on the video here. So I reached out to the owner and I got him back in here. We had about 5,000 miles on it. He said, didn't burn. He goes, I didn't add any oil. So he didn't add any oil. It was down a little bit. So it is still burning a little, but not near the rate that it was. So does it work? Yes, it works. Does it work faster than Berry Man's or Seafoam? Absolutely it does. I mean, we had this knocked out in about three hours. Um, I drove it for a week after we did this. And what I found out was when I first started driving it after we did this, it was burning oil. And I was like, man, this thing ain't working. This is just going to keep burning oil. I just wasted all this time, money, energy, everything. Um, after that week, it stopped. So it just took some time. It must have got the stuff on those rings loose enough that it was able to break everything free and stop the oil burning. So. Does that BG stuff work? Yes. Has the engine blown up? Not yet. Still going. So um, one of the other questions that are things that was mentioned in there was about the oil separator causing problems and contributing to oil burning. And we had changed that oil separator out. That was, that was first. Um, we went to pull the, uh, the, oil cap off while it was running. You couldn't remove it. It had so much suction on the thing. It was ridiculous. So, um, screaming away, sucking oil out. So we put an oil separator on it first before we went and actually did this BG stuff. So, um, yeah, works great. Car's running good. Um, burning a little bit, but hasn't had to add anything between oil changes. So does it work? Yes, it does. Um, the best way though, to prevent even any of this happening is to change your oil more often. 5,000 mile oil changes with a Euro oil. And I know, yes, it's expensive, but if you've paid to replace one of these engines or even try to source one out of a junkyard, you're going to end up probably with the exact same issues as, as this, this Audi had. So what's going to end up happening you know, is you're going to end up dealing with oil burning because 10,000 mile services on these direct injected cars, they, they just don't, they just make the ring stick. There's no, no way to get around it. So change your oil a little more often. You don't get that carbon buildup on there. It cleans everything out. Everything works great. You totally avoid the whole thing. So, um, I will jump into comments on this video. Like I said, we've been really busy the last couple months. We've been a little shorthanded. We're finally back up to full staff. Um, so, you know, I'll have time to do more videos. So my guys will be working on stuff and we're just going to jump in and, and shoot the videos. And I, I got my new, uh, we lost her social media person earlier in the year and uh, she had to, she left to go take care of her family. Um, they're getting a little older. So I got a new person in here to help with our social media. So he'll be kind of watching the comments and following up on this stuff too, you know, asking questions and we'll start shooting short videos and cutting this stuff to head out on all the rest of the social media too. So thanks for the comments and I'll see you later.